if I hadn't been at Taylor, I, I, I probably would not have made it to medical school. And I certainly would not have done well in medical school to the degree that I did. And um, I think that the lessons that I learned from Taylor and from Taylor basketball have carried over into um, the way that I practice medicine and take care of patients. If you're somebody who's really interested in, in academics as well as pursuing sports, uh, I think Taylor's a great place to go, especially with, in the basketball program. Uh, I do know that academics comes first. Personally, I want to go to med school and oncology school. I'd say being on the team mentally, we've been able to um, come through struggles and stressful situations and learn how to do that. And physically, we can push our bodies further than we ever thought we could push them. You're together so much with this same group of guys that you really build a, a camaraderie with one another. You build rapport with everybody, and it's almost a brotherhood. I think as a basketball player at Taylor, you have to learn to be flexible in, in my everyday life now as a, a school administrator. Just being able to listen and to motivate and encourage and hold people accountable. You never know what's gonna come across your desk. Just being able to apply the things that I learned as a basketball player into the real world has just proven to, to help me out on a daily basis. I would tell a recruit to come in ready to work and take your mind to a different place that has never been before, to take body to a different place that has never been before and be ready to be pushed and be ready to push back. Coming to Taylor it gave me more of uh, the feeling I had in high school where there's uh, more of a team atmosphere and people care. And I've, I've seen that not only through the, through the players on my team, but also through the student body and the administration and teachers. What's built the most camaraderie with this team is the Taylor atmosphere, uh, having to be around each other on and off the court. So you spend a lot of time with these, with these you know, 12, 13 individuals that um, you're, you're bound to grow a friendship and, and a trust between each other. It's bigger than something yourself. Yeah, it's, it's not about the, the fame and all that stuff that you see on TV, but it's, it's more about who you are in the locker room, who you are at practice. You know, you're always with the guys. You're, you know, right now I'm living with three of the guys in the apartment, so I see them from sunrise to sunset. We're always together. And talking about basketball and you know, talking about the hard things we've done, talking about the good things that have happened, what's to come, what we look forward to. And, and I couldn't ask for more out of my experience. Well, being on the team, everybody experiences the same things. And you go through conditioning together. You go through all the trials and the hard times together. And that really develops a team. You look out for each other. You know what everybody's been through. And that really helps to bring us together. And you know that we can rely on each other. Basketball just teaches you toughness, especially under coach. We're dedicated to what we're doing. And he expects nothing but the best from us on a daily basis. Every game was a big game, and so just knowing that the team you're playing, it was kind of like their championship night if they could beat Taylor. Like I said, when I year before I got there, the, the team finished top ten in the nation. Um, the four years I was there, we made it to the national tournament every year. I think perseverance is, you know, when you get out of college and you go into any type of job, it's it's a new environment. You know, something that I carry with me today is is kind of that same. You know, you just kind of have the willpower, the, the mental toughness that you need for those days when, man, you got a tough client and, you know, you're having to deal with or, you know, right now the stock market's really bad, but it's, you just have to have that positive attitude that it's tough right now, but I know I can see the light at the end of the tunnel. I know it's going to get better. Taylor is a very tight-knit campus. The Taylor fans were great, um, I, by far the best in the conference. The silent night games are, are perfect games when the whole school, whole campus is there. You know, we'd have guys in the dorm standing on the sidelines, you know, face painting, body painting, going crazy. And that's just something anywhere we traveled, in conference, out of conference, nobody ever had. And I think that's definitely a home court advantage. A lot of times for practice, Coach Patterson would always incorporate some type of scripture um, you know, something that he was reading in the Bible or, or reading in a, in a spiritual book and just kind of share that with us. The, the guys who are true coaches who really are coaching you through a sport for life and uh, are, are very few and far between. The chance to play at Taylor where the atmosphere is so uh, conducive to your physical growth but your spiritual growth and your mental growth as well as your academic growth is, is beyond compare. Taylor is a university that has everything that you need. It has 
uh, people who care about your future. And it's not just words, it's not just talk, it's real. You have to be there to experience that. It was the best decision I ever made in my life.